revisiting the three dharma seals of the Buddha. Number one, the relative is impermanent. Number two, the separate self does not exist. And number three, nirvana is the ultimate reality. Then we can see how these three dharma seals are interrelated. So impermanence is from the point of view of time. Non-self is from the point of view of space. The ego self is a localized hallucination <laughs> in space. And uh, if you go a little deeper, um, from the point of view of time, imper impermanence, from the point of view of time, impermanence is a transient pattern in the behavior of the universe, which in its essence is an abstract field of pure potentiality. So from the point of view of space, the localized self is a conceptualized local illusion in the bigger illusion, which is the theater of space-time and causality. Bottom line, there is only awareness experiencing itself as the universe and you and me as individuals are the intersection in the matrix of interbeingness. Now, this can cause a lot of uh, anxiety, even uh, some people see this as nihilistic, but if you break through the barrier of conditioned identity, there's liberation in knowing yourself as divine. You are the divine localized as a process called Homo sapiens. So Homo sapiens means uh, sentient being, wise one. Uh, Let's uh, make that label, wise one, true by uh, navigating across our ego identity.